Raven's flock, the flock rundown is the place to be. My man Ryan has been a lifelong Ravens fan since he was born. So I'm telling you now, it's about to go down. The podcast, the flock rundown. Ravens, baby. Nothing gets better than waking up and wondering how high we can fly. Tune in. Motionless brainwaves attempt to swim near where the sense can tame the untamed. Appreciate you, Ray. What's up, Ravens fans? My name is Ryan. Welcome back to another episode of the Flock Rundown. It's been a slow week. It's probably going to be a slow next few weeks until training camp. But we did get some video footage of Lamar and Zay Flowers working down in South Florida on the beach. Had a video of Lamar throwing some passes to Zay, so... They're working out. They're together. They're both from South Florida, so I am not surprised to see them working out together, but love to see it. Love to see this footage. Keep this footage coming. I hope that he joins up with Odell because Odell is also in Miami. He was seen with DJ Khaled golfing. They have a golf event in July, so he is down there, and I would imagine it's just a matter of time. Maybe by the time this video is out, we already got footage of Odell also working with Lamar and Zay and whoever else wants to come down there. But I just love to see Lamar working with the guys outside of camp, outside of the Ravens facility. Uh, We didn't get that with Joe Flacco. He would always like kind of mention like, yeah, I'd like to get together with the guys. And then it just like never happened. It doesn't necessarily have to happen. Like I still think you could possibly win a Super Bowl if you don't go work out with the guys. But who doesn't want to get better? Who doesn't want a further team chemistry or a quarterback receiver relationship, right? Especially with these new guys, like Lamar's never played with Zay, he's never played with Odell, he's never played with Nelson Aguilar. So it's important to get timing down. If Zay's running a route and coming out of a break, Lamar needs to anticipate that, you know, and Lamar needs to get timing down with each guy. Each guy has a different skill set that they shine with or or they have different speed levels and different quickness and different route running abilities and Lamar needs to learn that and get timing down with those guys so that when the season's here, there's a lot of anticipation and they're on the same page. I love seeing Zay and Lamar get working already. I can't wait for Odell to join them. Have to believe Odell's gonna join them at some point. They're gonna get a workout in while he's down there. I don't know how long he's down there, but I would expect them to get some working together. I'd be very surprised if Lamar doesn't work out with Odell or any of the other guys. We're a little less than a month from training camp now. This is the most excited I've been for Ravens offense in a long time we finally have the weapons and we finally have the coordinator I think I mean time will tell we'll see how this scheme plays out throughout the season but everything I've been hearing everything I've been seeing from Todd Munkin has been incredible I don't know if you watched the Ravens wired that dropped last night but the Ravens put out a mini camp wired on their channel I highly suggest you go check that out we get more of an inside look at Todd Munkin giving a speech and in meetings and then out on the field being playful with the guys and his energy is just infectious and it keeps being brought up that his coordinator style is to adapt the scheme around the players skill sets and we have a variety of skill sets at a variety of positions and I think that's a huge advantage and I think having a coordinator that doesn't come in with a preset offense It's not like Todd Munkin's coming in to Baltimore saying, this is my offense, learn it, this is what I run. He's evaluating the roster, looking at each player, and then designing an offense for them, for this team, and trying to figure out how to put each player in the best position and give them the best opportunity to succeed. So I think that that's a really great way to approach being a coordinator in the NFL, especially if you can develop an offense around pretty much any type of personnel there is a wide variety of personnel we have a great offensive line we have great running backs we have great receivers now and we have franchise elite top three quarterback in all of football so recipe for success in my opinion and Lamar working out with the guys in the offseason is just going to give them more of an edge when they get to training camp. And the sky's the limit for this team. We got high aspirations, Super Bowl aspirations. Can't wait for training camp to get here less than a month away. Let's go. 
preseason, and then before we know it, September will be here, and it'll be week one against the Texans in the regular season. Can't wait for September. I know you guys can't wait either, but for now, we got beach clips of Lamar and Zay Flowers in South Florida working out. Odell is also down there. I would expect him to join in soon. Look out for that video, or maybe they do it privately. I just think there'll be some footage of Odell and Lamar. But thank you guys for tuning in to another episode of the Flock Rundown. Have a beautiful rest of your day, and I'll talk to you guys again soon. Motionless brainwaves attempt to swim. They wear the sense, can't tame the untamed.